What's up everybody, before we start today's vlog, just wanted to say thank you for the amazing support that you guys have shown with the V2 necklaces, uh, with 50% of proceeds going to TC, Testicular Cancer Research and Awareness. You guys have been killing it, you guys have been posting pictures from all over the world showing your support. And I just wanna say thank you for that, it's really, really amazing. Uh, if you ever wanted to pick one up or want to pick one up, uh, the link will be down in the description. Now let's get started with the vlog. I'm in Princess Margaret right now, you guys can see. Um, <laughs> this brings back a lot of memories and they're not that long ago whatsoever. I'm about to go into a CT scan, drinking a barium solution right now. Uh, you drink this, or yeah, you drink this before you go and have a scan so they can see everything in your body. So right above me is the fourth floor. I'm on the third floor right now, it's where they do the CT scan in Princess Margaret. And the fourth floor is where I did chemotherapy for nine weeks straight. That's why I have no hair still. Some people keep asking why you got no hair and everything. Well, that's what happened. Well, actually, let's, let's take a look. There's, there's some stuff growing there and it's, it's growing. I feel like every day it's like a faster growth. So we're doing a CT scan today and uh, I'll be honest, I'm scared. You know, I'm optimistic and I'm positive about everything as I've been and so open. I, I, I don't know anyone online that, that's shown their story like I have and I'm not trying to show off and be like, oh, look at me or anything. No, I'm just, I'm, I'm open because I'm telling you guys that this is, this is scary. This is not easy right now. Reason being is I do this, I had, my life got turned upside down with this, right? And I tried to make the most of it. And uh, doing chemo, you know, I was life was going really well. Um, uh, amazing family, friends, fiance, um, strength. It was just it crushed the road to 700. Did a 700 pound deadlift, and I was like, okay, so 500 pound bench next, or or, or 600 pound squat, or something like that. So some good fun stuff. And then this came and uh, turned my life upside down. It turns a lot of people's lives upside down. And so today I, I go into a CT scan and I find out what chemotherapy did to me. And did it, did it kill off everything? And, and I have high hopes that it did, especially on the dose of chemo that I was on, which was very, very high, because it's always based on your height and body weight. And uh, my body weight was like 245 starting. I'm about 230 pounds now. Um, you know, pack on some muscle still, but I'm gonna go in for a scan and uh, I'm hoping that it's just, that this will be the end of it. That this will be the end of it. And uh, I can get on with my dreams, my life, my businesses, and maybe have a vacation and uh, forget about all this, you know? Well, you'll never forget about it, but you're always reminded. Um, but it's uh, not in a bad way sometimes. Sometimes it's all about, you've been through this, you can get through anything, it makes you stronger, makes you appreciate life much, much more. Sometimes I think it's, it sucks that um, some of us need to have a very negative moment in our lives in order to change our lives and appreciate life more. Sometimes you just need to stop and say, Life is pretty cool. You know, I'm alive, I'm doing this, I have these people in my life. Maybe your life isn't perfect, maybe there's issues and everything like that. But maybe you, you stop and you think about the people that are around you. Appreciate the little things. Anyways, uh, I've yabbered, yabbered. I need to drink my barium solution. I gotta drink this over the course of 45 minutes and then, uh, and then we begin, so. By the way, some people were asking what this tastes like. It's like a chalky, orangey, interesting delight we're all changed ready to go let's get this done and over with shall we all done here today um it's a pretty quick process once you get in there it was just a lot of waiting today a ton a ton 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 of waiting 
Um, so I was in there probably about an hour after I was supposed to be in there. And usually, so I drank my solution, and usually they uh, put an IV into you as well, and uh, and they inject another contrast as well. They didn't do that today, which was kind of odd to me, and apparently the radiologist said it wasn't needed. I don't know. I'm not I'm not an expert in this. So they, they are. I, I personally don't mind because my veins still aren't popping after chemo, so it's hard to find a vein anyways to put an IV in. So the fact that didn't have to put it in, that's kind of a bonus for me. Man, this weather, awful. It's raining, raining, raining. Probably not good for my camera right now, so I should probably put that away. So back home, it is Cinco de Mayo, May 5th. Uh, and what better way to, to celebrate than grabbing some, some Tostitos, some Tostito things, opening up some guac. I wish we could make fresh guac, but this will do for today. I'm enjoying a couple crisps. Mm. A couple crisps. Wow. A couple crisps. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. How you doing? I'm doing all right. Oh, yeah? Yeah, but hold on. I'll be doing better in one second. Please don't play an ad. Yes. Now it's Cinco de Mayo! <laughs> I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's wet. I should put on my shoe. All right, staying warm outside. Oh, that was scooper. Um, I am going to test out. Yep, they're super dry. Um, our wood pellet smoker and I'm just gonna I'm not smoking anything today I just want to make sure it works because like I said I don't know if you guys heard remember in the other vlogs I got these I got two of them uh, gave one to a friend because he was doing the exact same thing but I got two of them uh, one was shaped a little differently it looked like a barbecue definitely wasn't a barbecue it was just a smoker um, and I just want to test out to see if this thing is still functional so my ultimate goal will be to uh, hide a bunch of cable normally I actually kept the smoker right here but <laughs> the door is right there and when this thing smokes it smokes all over the place so what I want to do is take this guy and we're gonna take him um, all the way over here so it is an electric smoker and uh, let's turn her on and see if she smokes and if she works Okay, she plugged in. Ooh. It's like she never even got turned off. I'm put it to smoke level. So what happens is, I could open it up, but there's like this, um, what's it called? Um, Jonger, Younger. I can't remember right now. I can't remember. Uh, something that spins and it moves the pellets in there and then there's like this flame that uh, basically every time the pellets hit, they start burning and create that smoke. And so what we're gonna see is a bunch of smoke coming off from here. And my friend, this is probably one of my favorite features because the smoke goes through there and everything. So um, we're gonna see if she works momentarily. Don't know what the smell is of these guys. Kind of smells like apple wood. I think it's apple wood. These are the apple wood pellets. And they uh, produce a pretty good flavor, but I prefer, I think my favorite ones are the hickory ones. That smells amazing. Oh yeah. Got that smoke going. That's fantastic. Mmm. So good. Reminds you of camping. That's what it smells like. It smells like camping. I love it. So good. Mm. Well, we know if she works. Oh, well, hello. What do you do? Front squats. You do front squats? I do front squats because I want to improve my my catch on my cleans. Oh. She wants to improve herself. <laughs> yeah. That's good. Excellent. High five on improving yourself. That's I want to interview people like this with my mouth in my mouth. <laughs> But well, hey guys, that'd be a good one. I'm not doing French squats. 
No, sir. You don't remember what your old front squat was? I don't remember what my old front squat one rep. Sorry, one rep max was. Three rep max was 210. Uh huh. So I thought maybe I would be close to 200 for a one rep. You're pretty close. You did 175, you got 185. Now 175 went up like butter. You know, That's butter like. butter on toast, it went up fast. It went up really fast. I was there. I was right behind you. Did you smell anything then? I did, and I, that's why I left. All right, let's go. 185. Easy, easy. Yeah, but it was good. Yeah, but still went out fast. I, I know. But I, 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 I feel I could see, I could see, I could see where there was a little sticking point where you could, like, if you went heavier, you have a sticky point. And I would have dropped, and I'm not prepared to drop it. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm good. 185. You good? You good? Have five. You good? Double have five. But you good? All right, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog. Time to go out and uh, celebrate. Uh, this week will be a little bit weird until we get the results of everything, but uh, nonetheless, nonetheless, we stay positive, we stay optimistic, right, Pip? Yes. Yeah. And we stay. Stay fresh, stay fresh, <laughs> stay fresh. Uh, huge thanks to everyone that's been posting pictures with these necklaces all over the world. It's awesome to see you guys supporting such a cool cause and just like, I don't know, this is a huge symbol for me and a lot of you guys, D4L, I know a lot of you guys are getting even tattoos, uh, posting them and it's so cool to see that this this means a lot to you guys. So uh, thank you uh, for supporting, thank you for showing me and if you guys are wearing this, are living by d oh my God, you spelled so much. But it just smells Whoa. like, it smells like tea, don't. It smells like tea, don't lie. It smells like somebody took a big poop and then needed to refresh. No. It's, no. If you guys have these, or if you guys are living by D4L, dedicated for life, post your pictures, tag it. I wanna see, I really do, really do appreciate it when you guys do tag us in this stuff. Uh, it's just very, 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 very cool to see. Anyways, uh, I'm going to wrap this up. Um, if you guys have any questions in regards to the whole process, like always, uh, comment below. I know that there has been a lot of questions. I've been trying to answer them, I'm trying to answer them within IG, uh, Facebook, emails, and then within videos. Um, but obviously I can't address all questions out there. And uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's help one another where we can. I'm gonna sh shut it off here, wrap it up. Poker night with the boys. Melissa's gonna come too. She's gonna play some pinball. So stay tuned for some snaps. Actually, as I'm, that makes no sense. Stay tuned for some snaps. This video's going up later. You will see, have seen snaps. Yeah, you will have seen the snaps. You're gonna be like, oh my god, I wish I was there. Yeah, totally, totally. Anyways, wrap it up. Catch you guys later. As always, my friends, you guys stay sexy and stay hungry.